a child's safety, of course, is a parent's number one priority. Yeah, but as we know, the cost of all things that come along with a child is great and can certainly be a burden for families. As News Channel 5's Claire Kopsky learned, the Williamson County Health Department is looking for families in need of car seats. This click is one that makes us all feel safe. But for mothers like Mara Ramirez, it's a sound she was desperate to hear. Financially, you know, we're not stable to buy a $200 car seat and stuff like that. She has three kids, all in car seat age. My oldest just turned six, my youngest is about to be three, and my middle child's four. A full house, but unfortunately, it wasn't a full car until last week. He was out of a car seat for about two, three months. Mara heard the Williamson County Health Department might be able to help her, so she reached out. Sometimes it goes from boom, I need it now. You have babies that grow really quickly and outgrow that infant carrier because um, it only goes up to 25 pounds, most of them. So then they're in need of that next stage. Parents don't know, what do I get? What's the best for my child? And it's picking the best seat that is age and size appropriate for your child. And luckily we're able to help them do that. Crystal Nall is Williamson County Health Department's child passenger safety technician. She meets moms like Mara every week who suddenly need help with the car seat a job she takes very seriously. According to the CDC, it is the number one cause of injury and death for children in the United States. It can be greatly decreased just by buckling your kid up, having the right car seat, booster seat, and having them safely in their seat belt, and it can decrease as much as 80%. Needless to say, when Mara got the call that she qualified for a seat for her three-year-old, she says a weight was lifted. Heart dropped on the floor. It was a big relief for us. It's a program helping hundreds of kids in Williamson County buckle up. Carsey is what you ask for. The help is what they give you. In Williamson County, Claire Kopsky, News Channel 5.